Hi everybody, welcome back to KJK TV. Today we are doing part two of Hot Mama, or you can call it the Seven Baby Challenge. And we actually have our mom right here. And I'm sure, like usual, they always put the babies in a corner for some reason where it's super hard to get to, which is really weird. I don't really know why they do that. But we are either, we're going to download our house. So we're going to pick a house. Um, I think I'm just going to pick one for my gallery. And I really like this one. So I think we're going to go for this one because it has a cute little shed. And a car in the front. And it has a pretty decent upstairs. So we're going to pick this one. Let's hit download. We'll have it unfurnished so that we can customize it ourselves. And now we're just loading, waiting for it to load. Okay. So I think, oh, okay. It put the house this way, so I guess this is how we're having our house. Okay. Um, okay, that's weird. It said it had the car in the driveway. It doesn't. Let's get that car then. Let's see, I believe it'd be in here. We could just have a big giant bunny to show. We can ride that. That works. Up oh, here, this one looks like the car they had. And if we rotate it this way, that's pretty much the car they had. Okay. Now we're going to uh, look where they put our babies. Um, I need to try to find the babies now. Oh, you know, sometimes they actually do put them in your inventory. Yep, seven babies in my inventory. That's weird. Okay, now we're going to start. Let's start by the wallpaper. Let's see. We need some cute wallpaper. We'll use this. So this is going to be our, um, let's see, what could this be? We're going to make this our kitchen with a pantry, I guess because it has this little room over here. So this is gonna be our kitchen with a pantry. And this is going to be our dining room, so we can do that in a gray. Or more like, actually we'll just do a beige because this is the one I usually have the hallways with. So why not do the beige? On all the hallways and then the living room. Okay, now the living room is done being colored. Let's do the bathrooms and they're all gonna be this teal kind of blue there's three bathrooms downstairs I'm not really sure why and this is gonna be a bedroom and I think I'm gonna have this be the master bedroom so we're gonna do a purple there we go and that's all the walls for down here let's do the floors I personally like this one in the dark wood floor I'm going to make the whole floor this color because why not the bathrooms will change up a bit let's do the bathroom it's just plain dark wood like that and now that we have that done we can get on with some decorating so we're going to do the kitchen first I always start with the kitchen because I feel like it's the easiest thing to start with. We're, we're gonna pick a countertop. Let's see, this one's pretty. It's black. Um, yeah, why not, we'll do this one. Also, we're gonna need some countertops in here because this is going to be our pantry room. Let's put some, we don't need a whole lot in here because it's just gonna be for like a microwave and things like that. Let's put, um, I remember, I think when I usually use this house, I put it like this, and I end up liking it, so we're gonna do it like that. And then obviously we need a fridge, so let's take away one of these and put this. Okay, this fridge is okay. Um, let's do a stove. We need, I usually put the stove right next to the fridge, which isn't so smart, because actually, when I start the fire at the stove, because my sims are stupid, they catch the fridge on fire, which is the best thing in the world. Um, let's see, let's just add some curtains in here to make it look a bit more homey. We're just gonna do some basic curtains. Actually, these are a bit too big, 
going to choose some other ones. We'll do black, why not? Actually, that's a bit too big as well. Um, okay, I can't find the right curtains. Um, up here, these ones work perfectly, actually. Okay, let's just change the color. We'll just have them in gray because it's a basic color that you can't really go wrong with. Um, let's see, what else can we do with this room? It's a very tiny but cute room. Um, let's see. We have like a lump of coal. Everybody wants a lump of coal on their kitchen counter. Okay, let's see. The microwave's gonna go in the little storage room. Because if you have um, toddlers, the easiest thing in my personality I usually just give them chicken nuggets, but it might be too hard to like give every toddler chicken nuggets. I don't know. We have to figure out some strategies there. Let's get a dishwasher. I personally like the white one. Um, I think I should put my sink here, so maybe a dishwasher here. We'll have a dishwasher here, actually. No. Yeah, let's put the dishwasher here, and then let's get one more dishwasher in this pantry room just in case we end up needing a little extra cleaning support um let's get a kitchen sink i'm gonna get the white one and um, we'll just have one at the corner i guess and we can pick out a a garbage can that's just good i like the barrel one i think it looks the best out of all the garbage cans um let's see we need a smoke alarm we should put this on top of, well, pretty much on the stove. Can't put it exact, all right, you know, it's just gonna be blocked by the curtain, whatever. We need to put a heater right, right here. Um, actually, we'll save that and we'll put them in the bedrooms. So right here could be one. And we'll put ones upstairs too when we get to there. Let's see. Okay, we also need, um, actually we're not gonna have a bar stool in here because I think it's pretty full already. But let's add some decoration in here. Let's add a bread box. This brown one's cute. We're gonna get this one. And why not, let's put it in this room because we have nothing to do with this room anyway. You know, the brown one doesn't really show because of the countertop being black. So we're gonna choose, yes, we're gonna choose the rainbow house one to be a little bit more obnoxious, why not? Okay, let's put a paper towel. Actually, we're probably gonna need that space to cook so we can put our paper towel over here. And with some, um, actually, okay, that's good. <laughs> um, now we're going to find, what else? What else could we put here? We can put a fruit bowl. Let's see, we can put a fruit bowl in here some fruit and I think that's good for now let's add a carpet and call it done let's see we probably don't want a fur rug just in case of well we don't want fur rug white anyway let's do a black fur rug um I think that's good and let's add some lights in it um hmm I'm gonna do these ones Okay. Not the best looking lights, but they're not that bad. So we're gonna choose these ones. And just like that. Okay, now we're going to put one in the pantry because the pantry is like the same thing as the kitchen so we don't want different lights. Okay, now we're going to move on to the dining room. We are going to just pick a little table, I think. Like this one, it's very cute actually. I kind of like that. And hmm, let's choose these chairs, which are also really cute. Cute stuff today. And then, if I remind you, we are having seven babies. So I think we're going to need a lot of high chairs. So in the future, we're obviously going to need a lot of high chairs. So I'm going to put chairs, high chairs, everywhere. I um, actually I forgot to do my cheat baby dot. Move. Objects. Oops. There we go. 
now I'm going to now I'm going to move this all the way back a little bit. I don't know if they can actually get into that, so we might need to move that later. Let's put one in this corner too. Obviously, we'll have one in the middle of those two. So that's three so far. Let's see, we can put one here. And let's put a bunch over here because we're gonna need them. If I remind you, seven babies. Okay. Um, we need one more. Where are we gonna put it? Is the difficult thing. Um, I guess we can put it here and hope for the best. Meaning, hopefully they can get into it. I don't know if they will. Okay, well let's just hope they can. And in here, we will put a beautiful rug. Which one can we put? Let's see. Something cute. Maybe it's just the same fur rug. This one's kind of cute. I don't really like that one, actually. Okay, we're just going to do a fur rug. And since the whole room's kind of white, which is kind of weird for a dining room, we're going to choose that one, the white rug. Underneath all toddlers that might be messy. Definitely are messy. But it's a game, so. And we're going to add some flowers for decoration. I don't know if they can actually eat on that because of the flowers, but we can check that out later okay we need, obviously can't leave the room without lights um let's do some lights dining room light i'm thinking this one very white i mean it's a dining room let's see very cuter ones i want like a chandelier and this one's a chandelier so we're gonna try this one on top above not on top and we're gonna make it two so it looks even more like a chandelier and then for the rest of the room, we'll do these ones, which kind of match the chandelier. Mm -hmm. That's good. Oops, I messed that one up. Okay, let's put one there, and then we'll take this one and sell it. Okay. For the hallway, I think I'm just going to do the same lights, like here, 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 and here. Um, can't forget about over here <laughs> the lights aren't that bright but I think they're good for the hallway because the hallway doesn't need to be bright mm -hmm. take so much time placing the lights perfectly everywhere <laughs> okay that's as good as it's gonna get um for the hallway it is kind of boring and like a little bit I don't know how to explain it. It's just kind of boring. So I think I want to put like a table over here. So it's less boring. And maybe we can put another table somewhere else. These are my personal favorite tables. I think my mom actually has one of them. Um, we're going to put it there. And why not? Let's bring back in the flowers. It's fall in The Sims. So maybe daisies more? Daisies. Because they want to feel like it's summer. Because... Well, actually, fall is a pretty good holiday. I don't know why they want to feel like it's summer. They just feel like feeling like summer. <laughs> okay, we're going to get rid of this door and put this one in it here because it seems like every one of the doors have this one. I'm not exactly sure why they didn't just put it for the other bathroom unless it wasn't supposed to be a bathroom. But now it is gonna be, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, now let's do some bathroom things. Like, she's gonna, if she's gonna have baby, she's gonna have toddlers, and we're going to need a lot of things and baths, a lot of baths. So we're gonna choose this bathtub. It's a pretty okay bathtub. It's cute, and that's why I really like it, and it's for a boy or a girl, in my opinion. Now we need to go ahead and put a sink. I think I'm going to make a sink using this. Um, yeah, I think we'll just do that. And obviously we'll have to use these, but if there's one that match better, like this one, I think there's this one matches better. Um... And we're going to put one here, and then maybe we can make it look like... I think that works. Yeah, it doesn't look that bad. Okay. Makes it look a little bit better. Now we're going to need some sort of, like, table. 
to put here. Um, let's see. We'll use this one for the sink and for the bath. Okay. Maybe the sink won't have one because the bath needs one more. Actually, I think I forgot to put one by the sink, but we have the black carpet in there, so we're gonna let that go. All right, let's put the toilet. I think I'm gonna choose this toilet because I really like this one. It's one of my favorite toilets. Never thought I'd say that in a sentence. Um, <laughs> let's put some of the lights. I use these ones for my lights in the bathroom, but I'm not really liking this with the shower curtain. Let's see if we can find anything else. These ones are pretty. I got these ones from the job pack, which is a pretty good pack. You guys should try and get it or check it out. Okay. There we go. I think that's a good bathroom. Um, let's just real quick do this one. This one's not really anything special. It's just a bathroom. Honestly, all it's gonna have is a toilet and a sink. Um, wait, we should probably do the same toilet that I have in all the other ones. Well, the, okay, why am I getting confused? Okay, the toilet that I have in most of the other ones. And we'll do the same sink, why not? But why not give it a little bit potential, potential, and give it a mirror. We're gonna give this one a mirror too. I'm gonna give this one this mirror though, cause it can hold all their medicine in it. Cause if you're gonna have seven children, I'm sure you'll get colds a lot. And this is our girl over here. She's on her phone while her babies are in her inventory. Lovely mother, isn't she? <laughs> Okay, let's get back to the next bathroom, which I left the flooring of this bathroom because I kind of liked it. Um, let's go ahead and just give her a, she doesn't need a whole big bath. I think we're just going to give her this one, which I personally like. Yeah, she can just have this one. And then she doesn't really need a sink in here anyway, but we're going to give it to her because we're kind people. We give people sinks in here. That's what we do. Um, I don't know if she can actually walk in here because of all of that, so I think no tub for her. And she gets a shower. Let's give her a nice shower though, since that's the only thing she gets in her bathroom. This is a nice shower. Looks nice. Um, I think she'll be able to get in it. Should we test? I think we should test. Oh, never mind. We can't test because we need to put our babies down and we can't do that before we go up the stairs. So, <laughs> let's give her a little rug. We're going to give her a nice little... Oops. Uh-oh. Am I getting... Um, oh, it took me out. Um, not really sure why. Let's go back in. Okay. And we're going to give her a nice little moon rug. I like that one. And now let's... Um, what are we going to do? Should we do her bedroom next or the living room? I feel like we should do bedrooms last. And actually, before we even do the living room, let's um, put some decor. Meaning, pictures on the walls and things like that. So, in the kitchen, I'm not really sure what we could put in here. Um... I have some cute things though. Let's see. Mainly for oh, this one's kind of easy, I guess. Maybe. All right, we're gonna give her this sign on her kitchen wall. Um. Yeah, why not a coffee sign too? She sells. No, actually, this should be in here. Coffee, fresh baked coffee, fresh brewed coffee. <laughs> um, let's give her just a nice picture on the wall. So she has some decor in her room. Um, let's give her a black picture as well. And that's actually pretty good for in here. And then we're just gonna put a picture on the wall here and here. And that's good for this room. And for in this. Um, oh, it took me out. Um, not really sure. Why? Let's go back in. Okay.